Jurassic World 4 can bring back the Island Chris Pratt's trilogy totally forgot about. Jurassic World 4 is an exciting project for a lot of reasons, including the fact that it can bring back the Island Chris Pratt's trilogy completely forgot about. The Jurassic Park movies have evolved significantly since the first film's 1993 release, with the recent Jurassic World trilogy even bringing dinosaurs outside the islands where they were initially cloned and kept. However, before mixing the dinosaurs with humans, the first two Jurassic World films took place on the same island as the original movie, Isla Nublar. The fictional Isla Nublar is located a little more than 120 miles from the coast of Costa Rica, and it's where Alan Grant and his companions first come into contact with John Hammond's cloned dinosaurs. It's also where Hammond's theme park is supposed to be built. And while that doesn't come to fruition in the original Jurassic Park trilogy, Isla Nublar does house the resort scene in the Jurassic World projects at least until a volcano destroyed the place in Fallen Kingdom. Pratt's trilogy forgets about the other island from the early films, though and Jurassic World 4 offers the perfect opportunity to bring it back. While the original Jurassic Park and the newer movies are set against the backdrop of Isla Nublar, the Lost World and Jurassic Park 3 take place on a completely different island. The two sequels are set on Isla Sorna, also known as Site B. This is where Hammond's company, InGen, cloned and bred dinosaurs before transporting them to his theme park on Isla Nublar. Hammond sent a team of researchers there in the Lost World, hoping to stop InGen from using the dinosaurs for their own ends after he was ousted from the company. Jurassic Park 3 also takes Alan Grant there when he's duped into joining a rescue mission. While Isla Sorna plays a big role in the original trilogy, the Jurassic World movies never reveal what happened to Site B after Jurassic Park 3. They don't mention the InGen facility there at all, which is somewhat surprising since it started the chain of events that led to the titular theme park's creation. Additionally, Isla Sorna is only about 87 miles from Isla Nublar. It seems like the island's fate should have come up in the Jurassic World trilogy, but Pratt's movies forget about it. Hopefully, Jurassic World 4 can answer lingering questions about the fictional location.